Ground Potential Arise. This video is about the practical problem of GPR at Indravati Power House substation. 66 by 11 kV power transfer. The 11 kV neutral or thin conductor got melted. Some people said it is because of the high fault current in the neutral. But how could such a big size 95 square mm conductor got melted? Now we are about to investigate what is the reason behind this. We opened the marshalling box of power transfer and found that the boosting series secondary was not sorted and the connector was damaged due to the high voltage. We checked the boosting CD and thank god it was safe. Then we measured the neutral earth resistance and found that the 11 kV side neutral has an earth resistance of 130 ohm. The 66 kV neutral side has a resistance of 188 ohm and the grid resistance has 0.72 ohm. The substation in charge said that they had used to see sparking at this point with the 11 kV neutral conductor was kept together with the other control cable and power cable. On the very day when this accident happened, the substation in charge of fire where there used to be just sparking. We took a closer look and found that the control cable insulation was damaged and one of the single core XLP power cable was highly damaged. Because of fault in the power cable, the star point resistor in the 11 kV switchgear panel was also damaged. We measured the major value of transfer boosting and found all of the boosting were okay. Now we properly sorted the boosting CD and replaced the connector in the transfer marshalling box. We separately connected the neutral earthing conductor to the grid earthing and we improved the earthing contact. The damaged power cable was repaired and after all the necessary maintenance work, we charged the power transformer again. The neutral current on 11 kV side was found to be 4.59 ampere and on the 66 kV side was found to be 0.35 ampere with certain load on the outgoing failure. Ok, let's do a simple calculation of GPR. For a 10 ampere neutral current with a neutral resistance of 130 ohm, GPR will be 1.3 kV. For an improved neutral resistance of 0.72 ohm, the 10 ampere neutral current will produce a 7.2 volt GPR. Let's go to the conclusion. The LB neutral earthing conductor was not melted with a high fault current in the neutral. Instead, the fire started because of the sparking in the neutral due to the GPR and the power cable got the fire and then the power cable had a very large ground fault current. As the neutral was very close to the power cable, the ore fault from the power cable melted the neutral conductor. The main cause of this accident was GPR.